As part of Extreme's drive towards equality, two female STEM students are given the opportunity to gain valuable race week experience. We caught up with the ambassadors to hear about their first event. My name is Jessica. My name is Cynthia. And, and we're, we're Extreme East Dev Ambassadors. Our role is to primarily give paddock tours to VIPs. And what we'll do is usually give them, share facts that we've learnt. We're asked to run different sorts of, you know, errands, which I think is amazing because no two days are exactly the same. We definitely, like, spread ourselves out as far as we could. I've had the opportunity you know, to speak to people and mention Extremely and what I was doing in Saudi and every time they're like wow that's absolutely yeah. amazing because it's not just tours it's not as simple as oh you know we were giving tours there's so much more than that because we were essentially absorbing information like sponges throughout mm -hmm. the week. So okay. this is the command center we were able to take some people in there they have headphones as well so like you can listen into what people are saying and like the teams are discussing. Yeah and we were each given a person to escort from the command center. So basically I was in charge of team principal yeah. you were in charge of the, the driver, driver for the winning team. Yeah. So when I was taking Fraser on the second race it was really cool because I was like oh my god congratulations and there's so many cameras kind of following us so yeah that was pretty awesome to kind of witness like up close so. As as you can see, we're always doing side quests here. Sadia is now part of the sword dance. This is a traditional Saudi dance. And I don't know anything about Saudi dancing. I don't know if you knew anything about Saudi dancing before this. I just remember, I like, yeah. I was in the middle of a conversation. I turned around and I saw you like have a sword <laughs> and just dancing. And I was like, oh yeah, she's definitely getting video yeah. of this. We are making friendship bracelets. Write my name on it. They wanted us to make some friendship bracelets for each of the drivers. And then later they were presenting on the TikTok to like all the drivers with their really reactions because they were so like excited. And then we like later found out that more bracelets were made because some people were jealous that they didn't get any. So we were just so happy, just like so nice to be like that close. Cause then when you like look back, it was like rows of people behind oh, us. Yeah. Everyone was kind of gathered together to watch it, which is awesome. And yeah, seeing it up close, I was just like, wow, I'm actually seeing like it live that close. I think the main thing that Extreme E want us to get out of this is experience and networking opportunity and kind of build basically stepping stone into the motorsport industry. For us, it was just so nice being like in a safe space, which is not like very common in motorsport, I think. It was just an amazing opportunity to learn so much, but being on site and being able to absorb that is just something that's like so, so invaluable. Thank you for watching guys. And if this is a YouTube video, then what do they say? Like, comment and subscribe. subscribe.